A social studies teacher at Washington High School got quite the surprise today. Allison Turhorse is being honored with a Milken Educator Award and a $25,000 prize. She's South Dakota's only winner this year. Kelloland's Matt Holson shows you why she's considered one of the best teachers in the country. Disguised as an event kicking off a civics education initiative, the program got underway with a lot of fanfare. But after dancing around the surprise, it was time to reveal the true purpose of the get together an assembly to honor teachers. Because they have the responsibility of preparing all of you for a bright future. One in particular today, Allison Turhorst, who had no idea what was coming. Jane Foley with the Milken Family Foundation had the privilege of giving away the Milken Educator Award. It's known as the Oscar of Teaching. The Milken Educator Award goes to Allie Turhorst! Her horse, blindsided by the announcement, came down to accept the award and its $25,000 prize in front of hundreds of cheering high school students. To say this was a surprise is an understatement. That's because the winner thinks she's surrounded by other excellent teachers at Washington. Turhorst loves the profession so much, she helped create a teacher pathway program in the district. Teachers, um, they don't get the recognition that they deserve. And um, I teach a, a class for kids who want to become future teachers, and every day I'm telling them that what they do is important and um, becoming an educator is important. The Pathway program helps aspiring teachers earn college credit as they explore all facets of teaching. Fitting from someone who's admired by so many for her work ethic and connection with students. You are able to affect the lives of others, and I'm just so humbled by today. So thank you so much. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. From the bottom of her heart, and now to the top of her profession. In Sioux Falls, Matt Holson, Kelloland News. You can't apply or be nominated for the Milken Educator Award. The foundation finds you. If her horse looks familiar, it's because we have featured her before on Kevin Land News. Each year, she hosts a day of kindness at Washington known as Coincidence Day. It's in honor of her daughter who died in 2012.